Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. Welcome to another video uh, from our channel, Truth Prevails TV. Uh, I, hope, I hope you are doing well. Uh, we thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who has preserved our lives up to now. Uh, I hope Ramadan is going well. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept our ibadah. May Allah accept our fasting. May Allah accept our siyam, our kiyam. Uh, may Allah accept our sadaqa in this month and beyond. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala shower his mercy over us. So quickly, brothers and sisters, uh, what I want to do in this video is just to uh, share with us uh, and remind us the uh, sheer importance of looking, our, looking after our heart. As Rasulullah well, 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 said that our heart is the most important organ in our body. Uh, as it was wanted to have said that in this day that in this hadith, Rasulullah was supposed to have said that there is a flesh in the body. If it is sound, the entire body is sound. And if it is corrupt, the entire body is corrupt. Listen, it is the heart. Undoubtedly, our heart is the most important organ in our body. Therefore, it is extremely important that we make sure that our heart is always in good state. Uh, having a sound heart significantly helps us to do good, good deeds, to perform righteous deeds. Uh, sadly, a lot of people that are wicked, there is a problem with their heart. Uh, committing atrocities, uh, committing crimes, committing evil acts, uh, you know, there is a link, there is a connection with the, the state of that person's heart. A perpetrator of the, of, the, of the atrocity, there is a connection between what happens, what goes on in the heart of that person and the action it carries out. Hence, we, we cannot afford to let our heart be in a bad state. That's why we need serious du'a at all times. We need serious du'a at all times. And this, the du'a I would like to share with us and remind us of uh, in this video is one of my favorite du'a of the 40 Robanos. One of my favorite du'a among the 40 Robanos, which is Robana, la tu se kulubana, ba da izea de itana, wa abulana min la du karahmatan. In this supplication, uh, we are asking Allah that our Lord, oh our Lord, don't let our heart go astray after you have guided us. Don't let our heart go astray after you have guided us. And grant us from yourself, mercy. Grant us mercy from yourself. You are the bestower. You are the bestower. Allah is al Wahhab, the bestower. So we are calling upon Allah to let not our heart deviate from the right path. So this dua is so important for us to be making this month of Ramadan because we don't want to go back to mistakes we are making. But this we are performing before Ramadan. Ramadan, as we all know, is the month designed to rejuvenate us spiritually, to cleanse us spiritually of our sins. As Rasulullah well as was supposed to have said, more so more Ramadan, Imanan, what is happening, good for Allah, more Kadamana Bidambi, that whoever fasts the month of Ramadan out of sincere faith and open to attain Allah's reward, Allah will forgive all his past sins. So this month of forgiveness, we don't want to go back to the mistakes we are making before Ramadan, prior to Ramadan. We don't want to go back to all the sins, all the, all the bad things we are doing post Ramadan. So it is extremely important, it is crucially important to always make this dua during this month and after this month. Rob Banner, let to see Kulu Banner, by the Zia de Tana, 
Pabila na min ladu kalhamata inna kalam talohab. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant you a nice sound head and our loved ones. May Allah make our heart to be in good state at all time. So this is where I'm going to bring this uh, video to a close. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, uh, Tooth Prevails TV, please subscribe to it, like this video, share this video. So until then, Assalamu alaikum, rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh.